That's good. That's promising. That means this one will get a 10, too. It means he handled them with care when he signed his cards. This is Tops Finest Flashbacks 2023, a full case. <laughs> just coincidence, just coincidence. When Backer and I do Dynasty together, it's going to be amazing. Backer and I are going to do the Dynasty release together, I think. Or at least I'm going to ask him if we can. I think it'd be fun. Bowman Draft Sapphire, Bowman Draft Jumbo are the next two breaks. HTA is also very close to full. HTA is also very close to full. Looks like those three breaks are the menu right now. Flashbacks, Bowman, we've done a lot of Bowman Draft Jumbo today. I just feel like we've got a few nice cards, but I still think we can hit like a, like a real crazy, you know, nutty, ridiculous card. We haven't, like the Gallop is beautiful, but we haven't hit anything like no supers, no like, no red autos no you know i feel like i feel like there's something hiding in these cases sapphire two boxer it did bass i said on wednesday that i was going to move it to friday or to saturday this week pop will be on tomorrow pop will be on tomorrow sorry about that bass i told everybody on wednesday i apologize if you didn't hear yeah pop will be on tomorrow saturday this week instead of today just just for just for this week. Just for this week. They're so hard to hit, Ash. It's so weird. If Top still has like if Fanatic still has a supply, they've gotta be backloaded or something. For business, I assume, Bass? I've seen them, like, twice. I've seen them, like, very few times, Ash. I've seen, uh... I've seen Alonzo. I've seen Sanga. I may have actually seen them all, but very, very, very few times. How do you know, Bard? <laughs> Shannon, it's basically like there's only a handful of teams that can hit autos. And then other than that, it's about the it's about the refractors and the peels. Bench is a fun one. Honestly, I love flashbacks. I Backer would probably kill me if he heard me right now, but this isn't my favorite year of it. I'm not in love with this particular year of flashbacks, but there are a lot of cards. A lot of there are a lot of aspects to this year that I like, but I do kind of prefer it the traditional way with like the color and stuff. I'm looking forward to next year's flashbacks. I, yeah, exactly. I, I get that they stayed true to the 1996. They stayed true to the 1996. They really copied it shot for shot. It just, it just doesn't, you know, it's, it's this, I'm not, I'm not like knocking them really for doing what they did. Like, I'm not saying it was a good or a bad decision. Did they really stop it? Dale, don't say that. Don't, don't mess with me like that. Are you serious?
Dale, don't mess with us like that. I hope that's not true. It's a great product. How could they how could they discontinue flashbacks? That sounds crazy. I can't I can't imagine that's true. Flashbacks is great. If they discontinued it because of this year, then shame on them. It's nothing it's what they what they did was like not wrong with this with this throwback 96. They stayed true to it. Again, like I'm not knocking them for that. I don't I'm not saying that it was a bad decision. I think it was a decision that was made and I think it was a reasonable decision. It's just not my personal favorite. It's not there's nothing it's not really like they did anything wrong. I, I don't know if I'm saying this explaining myself well enough, but they didn't do anything wrong, but it's still just they can do nothing wrong, and it can still not be my favorite. You know what I mean? Like, just we're allowed to like what we like. I'm just telling you my personal opinion. I know there's plenty of other people that may, maybe they 96 is their absolute favorite, and they love this product more than the other flashbacks, and that would be totally fine. In fact, I'm sure that's the case with some people. A little bit, BMAC, yeah. Yeah, I would say this is one of my absolute favorites, too. No, so it used to be actual peels, Chris. So back in the day, the peel cards were legitimately peels. Like, you could hypothetically peel the protective cover, the protective peel off of the cards. You didn't want to do that. It would make it less valuable. But now they make... The peels, but it's like it's it's like a parallel. You can't actually peel the card. It's not a legitimate actual peel. But they're numbered to ten. They have uncommon, common, and rare peels in this year's flashbacks throwback, and they're all numbered to ten. They're to ten and that's it. What's up, Stila? No. That's sick. I didn't see your comment about that. I saw that he hit the Alonzo Super. I didn't know that it was for you. That's awesome. That's awesome. The Alvarez Super. Alvarez is going to be... I mean, he's our catcher of the future, bro. He's, he's the catcher of the future for the Mets. He's an absolute stud. The Mets have a really good lineup. I know their pitching is going to be pretty questionable, but the Mets have a good lineup. Yeah, people are really sleeping on Alvarez. He's going to spank 30 home runs. I was going to say 30 without blinking. 35 at least is my opinion. If he gets to 40, I wouldn't be surprised. I'm thinking like 36, 38. I'm thinking like 36, 38. Yeah, he's a kid. He's a stud. He's he's the real deal. He can really hit. Yeah, I, I disagree as well. I think they're going to leave him as the catcher. I totally disagree. I agree with Ash. You've never hit one, Shannon? Are you serious? What? Danny, you're hilarious. <laughs> I think he stays a catcher for quite a while. And I think they end up trading Parada. Um, I definitely did take a look, and there wasn't anything new except... There was a couple things that were new, but nothing that I can add to the store right now. But nothing what we were really looking for, just some other unique stuff. Um, I added some two-box pick-your-teams of Bowman Draft Sapphire. I added Bowman Chrome Hobby. I added Bowman Chrome HTA. I added Flashbacks. I added Bowman Draft Jumbo. Um, Sterling should be here on Monday. 
I'm hoping the other stuff is also here in that sort of time frame. Backer is out of town. Derek and Mark took care of some ordering some stuff, and I, I can't, I don't control uh, the mail just like I don't control the weather, but my sources tell me Monday is the, the goal, and if not, then Tuesday. I do think HGA will go tonight. Yes, I do, Shannon. I do. I think we're going to do this. We're going to do draft Sapphire and Bowman, draft Jumbo, and then HGA. It, we ship three times a week, Gavin, so it all depends on when your breaks are done being sorted, and um, and that's it. You get an email when, you, when, they get, when they get sent out. If you have any shipping questions at all, email shipping at theblast.com. Derek is the guy. He's super nice. He's also really good at what he does. If you have any questions about shipping, email there. Derek can help you. We have the greatest shipping and sorting department in the world, period, when it comes to this industry. I can say that with confidence. Second to none. So, uh, yeah, you get your cards pretty quick. Occasionally on a crazy busy release week, maybe it takes like a week, but in general, you'll be pretty good. Good luck. The refractor hunt is on. <clears throat> Let's get it. Let's get it. <clears throat> Uncommon of Reese Hoskins. Uncommon of Matty Chapman, who I just, I, th I think he's going to have a good year for you, Dale. Beatty on the rookie piece. I really do. I think Chapman's going to do well. Gabe Moreno, rare. Rookie rare for the Diamondbacks. The air up there is rare for Mr. Neo. Manny Machado on the uncommon. Let's find some freaking... There's Corbin on a base. Let's find some freaking spicy pieces here. Let's get some spicy meatballs. Show me some spicy meatballs. Uncommon of Logan O'Hoppy. His girlfriend is a looker. Uncommon of Morel. And there we go. We'll take that to start, Ash. If that's not some foreshadowing or a little something-something to start. Beatty on the refractor. It's not a super, but it's a refractor. We take it. Rare of Roger Maris for the Yankees. They're not dating anymore, no way, Bard. He moved on to to bigger and better things. That's so disappointing. I thought we liked her. Don't go out. Don't well, Shannon, where are you going? Where'd you going? Corbett on the base. Is that Pena? Pena on the uncommon. Volpe. D.L. Hall, uncommon for the Orioles. Garrett Mitchell, I think he's, if healthy, I think Garrett Mitchell is pretty underrated. People don't, I think people are sleeping. Ooh, Bobby Witt, refractor. Okay, I see you. I see you, Athletic. It wouldn't be a, it wouldn't be a, a flashbacks break if Athletic didn't, look, didn't get a little something, something. Um, <laughs> who was I just saying was underrated? Garrett Mitchell, that's right. Garrett Mitchell, he's not bad, dude. He's not bad. If he's healthy, he's good. Knock, knock, knocking on hands down. That's sad, Bard. R.I.P. Jita, the captain, number two, for our Brandon J. Derek, Jita. Uncommon of the Shures while he was still on the Mets. Two different colored eyes, but that's okay. Gunner on the base and Adley on the rare. Knock, 
Didn't Bob Dylan write that song? Giancarlo, he's uncommon for the Yankees. Going to Brandon J. Cabrian, he's uncommon for the Pirates. Gunner on the base, try to slide right by me. Lindor on the uncommon, and there's Albie and the Chipmunks for the Mets. Alvarez. Uncommon of Brandon Crawford. Mama, take this band from me. Javi Baez, he's terrible. An uncommon. Sorry, Tigers. Goldie, he's not terrible. Uncom a refractor, common refractor for the Cardinals. Going to the onion. The raw onion, if you will. Alec Thomas, uncommon Diamondbacks. And rare air up there for the White Sox. Going to the plumber. It's the big hurt. Mr. Nugenics himself. I do think Beatty puts it together this year. Yes, I do. I think he does. My answer is yes. Like a confident yes. So the uncommon is, yes, yeah, silver is uncommon. The bronze is common. Silver uncommon. Rare gold. My if you guys want to join the fantasy leagues, they're 150 or 1500. I got the information at the top. Just send an email to me. I'll send back all the information of the league, and then you can decide if you'd like to join. No pressure. I don't care if you join or not. I'd like you to have fun. My leagues are draft, and then you're done for the season. There's no act, no transactions whatsoever. If you want more information, like I said, send an email to the link of the pin message, but there's no transactions. It's just going to be no free agents, no waiver wire, no trades, no nothing. Just you draft your team, and everybody plays every day. There's extra positions. There's extra positions to compensate for the fact that I understand people are going to get hurt. Um... So this way they won't affect quite as much. It's head-to-head. -head. No rake, obviously. I think Beatty puts it together for sure. I think the Mets, I think the Mets have a nice young system. I hope they don't trade away too much, but they're definitely going to trade away Parada. We agree with that. We agree on that one. Uncommon of Joey Votto. Young for the Rangers there on the base. Gunner on the base. Uncommon of Arenado. Cardinals. Grisham uncommon. Rare air up there of what's your name? <laughs> Tovar for the Rockies and Ash. Yeah, I mean, you get used to it. You get used to it, Shannon. Garrett Cole on the Uncommon. That's a nice card. Uncommon Refractor for the Philadelphia Phillies going to Stu. It says Refractor. See? You know what? I could zoom in a little bit. Why not? It says Refractor, but... Well, yeah, it's refractor like look, like, like the regular uncommon doesn't have that shine, you know, it doesn't have that. 
rainbow, looks like a spilled oil sort of color. Uncommon of Kyle Tucker for the Strohs. What are the odds on the Strohs? Ooh, we have a peel. What are the odds on the Strohs winning um, their division this year? Trey Turner, uncommon. I feel like it might be a good bet. We have a rare refractor, too. Holy crap. Rare refractor legend of Nolan Ryan. The Ryan Express gets a rare refractor. That is a very, very difficult hit. There's only about 25 to 27 of these in existence. Chris, you're running good, my friend. That is a very hard hit. Rare refractor. The refractors are, like, really big. Plus 102 for the Astros to win their division. I feel like that's I feel like that's kind of free money. I like Texas, or uh, I'm sorry, I like I like the Astros to win the division. Probably, I really do. All right, we have a rare refractor of Nolan Ryan, but we also have a peel, an uncommon peel. The common refractors, there's about a hundred and like seven of them in existence each. A hundred and four to a hundred and seven is the print run on the rare on the uncommon refract on the common refractors. The uncommon refractors, the print run is like fifty fifty five, around fifty five, fifty three, fifty five, fifty four, something like that. And then the rare refractors, it's like twenty four to twenty seven, something like that. Basically 25, 50, and 100 if you want to keep it simple. Uncommon peel. Here we go. Corbin on the base. <laughs> it's a Met. Ash. Ash gets the Alonzo to 10 on the uncommon peel. It's first in the print, too. One out of ten. One out of ten. Very crispy. Very crispy peel. I know, right, Ash? Exactly, when it rains. Beautiful hit. A nice peel, and, and to be honest, no disrespect at all to Alonzo uncommon peel to 10, but like rare refractor of Nolan Ryan, that is a hard ass hit. Rare refractors are very difficult hits. Very, very difficult hits. Hunter Green, uncommon. Bo Bichette, he's uncommon. Volpe base. Lou Bob, he's uncommon. Gunner base. Can't tell if that's, I don't think that's autographed. It's just a rare. Uncommon of Acuna Jr. Corbin on the base. There's a rare. Maris for the Yankees going to Brandon J. There's our refractor of this box, Ruiz. There's one refractor per box. Ruiz. I like tag too, Ash. We talked about this before. Very nice. Yeah, Seattle's going to have a great rotation, for sure. Uncommon of Chris Bryant. Who's got Oakland? Ash. <laughs> of course. Sure. Like he said, when it rains, of course. By the way, we've already got six refractors and we still have another box. I wonder if we have a bonus refractor. We probably, they're more likely to short us a refractor in that last box than they are to give us a bonus, but we've gotten bonus before. I see no reason why we can't get lucky now.
No, no, no auto yet. I usually try to save the auto for the end. This time it's coincidental. I didn't see where it was. I actually thought it was... Oh, yeah, it's in this box. I think it's in this box. We'll save it. We'll do the other... We'll finish the other box with the other box first. Yeah, the auto's right there. Put that down. Pick up most of the rest. Beatty on the rare. Mets. Ash, how you doing? Volpe, Yankees for Brandon. Very nice. Double New York rookie on the rare there. Bobby Witt on common. That's a pretty strong handful. Bobby Witt on common. And then Volpe and Beatty on the rares with an auto still in the chamber. No, Ryan didn't sign in this. He's not in this one. Not in this year. Um, I'm going to be a huge A's fan. I mean, Ash, I'm a Mets fan from childhood. I'm 1 million percent going to gonna root for the A's. There's our another. We got a bonus refractor. We did. Tolia, Rockies, Ash. <laughs> this is crazy. Ash, did you get every refractor or something? Um... No, in all seriousness, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be an A's fan when they're here. I mean, I, I'm a Mets fan first. That guy Torque, by the way, he's gonna have a nice season. Um, I'm a Mets fan first, but I'm gonna get season tickets to the A's here when they move here. My my house is like, bro, my house is like three minutes from the stadium, the temporary stadium they'll be in. Springer uncommon, rare of the big hurt. Your second one of those. That's tough. Nice hit for the White Sox, the Palmer, with two big hurt rares. I look forward to getting season tickets for the A's. I'll, I'm going to get great tickets. I'll, I'll take my wife to every game. It'll be great. Uncommon of Devers. Like, seriously, it'll be so much fun. Tristan on the rare. Red Sox with a late hit. Let me sleeve these last few pieces, and then we'll show the ink. Exactly. Like, what's wrong? I'm not, I'm a, I'm allowed to be an, an A's fan, right? Since I'm I'm a Vegas I'm a New York Vegas transplant. I feel like I'm allowed to be an A's fan. Let's go, Chris. I'm in, bro. Let's do it. That's actually perfect, Chris. That's perfect. I'll split the I'll split the season tickets with you. That's perfect. That's perfect. Cause I going you know this way we could go to some games together. You could take your your lady. I'll take my lady. I'm I'm actually like really excited, Dale. I'm excited to be an A's fan. I'm excited for Vegas to have baseball. Yeah, I'm in, Chris. Hundred percent, bro. That's perfect. I split uh, season tickets to the Rangers with my buddy when I lived in New York for a couple years, and that worked out perfectly too. So this I know this will be great. Um, and on. That note. Let's show an autograph, huh? Let's show an autograph. Good luck here. It's very hot, Bard. <laughs> Good luck on the ink. It's a legend. And just like that, Somebody asked, where are all the Derek Jeter autos? I always hear that Blez gets all the Derek Jeter autos in Top's Finest Flashbacks. And there he is. The captain. Your captain. My captain. Number two. Derek. Jeter. They are definitely building a dome. They have to. It's going to be like the most expensive dome ever, like in Arizona with the whatever, because the heat, 100%, they'll need a dome. Let's go, Brandon. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Jeter shows himself. All autographs beat the sword here. Out of flashbacks.
do 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 do. The captain. I think him and Ichiro are the two best autos you can hit in this product, I, I believe. All right, let's do a Rizzy recap of all the beauties. Gunners and Corbins. It's a fair fight. The Rares. The Refractors. Talia, Galdi, Bobby Witt, Beatty, Estri, B. Harper on the Uncommon, Nolan Ryan on the Rare, and then an Uncommon Peel, first in the print of Alonzo for the Mets. One out of ten. Last, but definitely not least, we have the captain with some ink, Jita, for Brandon and the Yankees, beating the sort. Congratulations on the Jeter auto. We'll put him back there. The captain will join us on the mantle for the rest of the night. That was a full case of Top's Finest Flashbacks from this year. PYT 164. Thank you, everybody that participated. Congrats to those that got some stuff. I apologize to those that did not. That was the break.